Hi, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. And this is Jollibee. The what? This is Gabby. The what? Yes, Jollibee. <laughs> <laughs> it's really nice, you know, when you've done something a certain amount of times, you just know that you can nail it every time. Every time. <laughs> Basically, a while ago, we were inundated yes. in messages. Heinz have released this ice cream only in the UK based around their sources. It must be the world's most Wait, famous what? condiment brand. What Google is to search engines, Heinz is to sources. So they made they ice creams? They, well, I got excited. I went on their website and they're selling ice cream, right? Okay. I was okay. just like, select everything. Okay. The ketchup was sold out. Let's bring out the ice cream, shall we? Heinz creams with a Z. Wow, first up, we've gone with salad creams. I've never had salad cream. I don't think they have salad cream in the States. I think this is a British thing. It's a really random sauce. I'm looking forward to this. I don't even know what. Hmm. I don't even know how to describe it. Tastes like a sour mayo. It's yeah. like the Thousand Island salad yeah. dressing. Yeah, it's like oh, less good Thousand Island sauce. <laughs> yeah, it's like 100, 100 Island. <laughs> <laughs> Do the honors. Yeah, open it up. Oh, it looks like ice cream. Wow. I don't know uh, how I feel about this. This is gonna be like sour and salty ice cream. There you go. Cheers. Cheers. Salad cream ice cream. This is the taste of next summer. <laughs> it literally tastes like egg flavored ice cream. Oh, really, uh, really cold mayo. My first re reaction was to gag because it, it tastes like it's off. Do you know what I mean? Like, it like it's eggy, but it's really creamy real. and I kind of want more. Oh, you're weird, Josh. You know when you're falling in love and you get this giddy <laughs> sense <laughs> that you just don't really know what's real anymore? I'm not sure whether that's what I'm feeling <laughs> or whether, you know, you get a giddy sense right before you puke. It's one of those. Are there serving suggestions for this? An indulgent dessert is especially delicious when paired with the sweetness of summer strawberries. Wait, there's pairing suggestions? Okay. <laughs> what is going on? It looks good. We have full pairing suggestions for this. Wow, there must have been a lot of like... This is commitment. They've the really developers. gone for it. All right, Gabs. Okay. Just one bite. Oh, it's so sour. I don't know. Oh, I'm hot. It makes it way better. Yeah, in that it just, just tastes, tastes like strawberry. strawberries. Yeah. With like an awesome taste of egg. All right, salad cream ice cream. No. Salad cream. Will it ice cream? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next up, guys. Yeah. Blue. Oh. oh no, the real mayo is here. Oh no. <laughs> okay, now I am way more excited about this than salad cream ice cream. Salad cream, because I just don't even like by itself. Whereas mayo makes things better. Oh, so weird. This is so, so strange. I can only smell the wafer, actually. Right? It's not that bad. It's surely better, gonna be better than salad cream. Have you guys ever made mayo at home? No. This is literally oil. So egg. this is not This that. is oil and egg ice cream? Yeah. That's so weird. All right, let's do it. Cheers, guys. They've been so not excited about ice cream. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna fall for that face. It's not right bad! Now. You said that uh, last time! Oh, I didn't want to hate it because it was our first one. But I it was don't know awful. what, it was I, awful. I can taste the mayonnaise. That is literally 10 times better than I'm, the last one. I'm getting oh, some more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The suggested topping for this is, this smooth creamy ice cream is delicious paired with apple and blackberry compote topped what? off with a layer of crumble as a perfect what? summer pudding. We are flipping <laughs> crumble! Me. Oh, you're dipping. She knows what she's doing. Mm. Oh, it's better. I think they're pairing this so that you can mm. taste the mayo. It's just subtle, Gabby. It's like mm. having a crumble with a bit of a bit of ice cream on the side. Yeah, I, well, yeah. Mm -hmm. I legit think recipe. you could sell this. You could. And people would buy it because it's a gimmick, but they wouldn't be disappointed. No. Whereas you'd buy the sour cream one for a gimmick and you, you, you would never buy that again. Keep that, put it back in the fridge. I'll finish that later. All right. Mm. That was good. Yeah, I, I love this combination. Next up. Next up. All right, now okay, I feel like oh I feel like gosh. they've lulled us into a sense of security with that mayonnaise. Oh no, oh my gosh, oh no. Classic barbecue sauce. Now, I'm not a big fan of barbecue sauce. Me neither. I don't have my it with anything. My least favorite sauce. Chris. Okay, it's, it's more subtle of a color. Oh, <laughs> oh no. 
That smells like frozen pork rib barbecue. Oh, it does. It does. All right, guys. Barbecue ice cream. All I can smell right now is barbecue sauce. Oh, shoot. I can't, man. It's my least favorite flavor. I'd rather have salad cream. <laughs> what? It tastes like Think licking about. a spoon of barbecue sauce, is what it tastes like. I mean, it is creamy, but it almost makes it worse. Is there a serving That's suggestion? Bad. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Suggested topping. The smokiness of the barbecue sauce is perfect when paired with some crispy bacon bits, pecan pieces, and maple syrup. Oh, Adam. Grace, you guys have outdone yourself. What? We're basically, it looks like we're at a flipping restaurant. Okay, I'm just sticking in some pecan pieces. Yes, pecan pieces. That's the American pecan. say. How do you say it? Pecan. <laughs> <laughs> Literally said no one ever. Okay, <laughs> let's do this, guys. Okay. Oh, I feel like I'm having brunch. You know what I mean? If you go like to a hip brunch place, they have like bacon. <laughs> oh, it's bad. It's bad. The ice I cream. Like the it. ice cream base is awful. Oh. <laughs> okay, so the problem with this is right. Yeah. Don't make the sauce the centerpiece of the meal. The question needs to be: Would you like some barbecue sauce with your your bacon and pecans? But no. this is: Would you like some bacon and pecans okay. with your flipping plate of barbecue sauce? Exactly. No one wants that. Josh, look. Okay, have this bite here. Okay. I put more right. nuts. And the ice cream base Only is just ruining it for me, but I'm fine. Yeah, there. Ah. Oh. No. <laughs> Better, but, oh. It's like a choir where there's this one singer who just can't sing and they are the loudest singer all and no the, one's got the heart the to say to like, them Sing louder, sing louder, you think it's going to be fine and then it comes to part of the song where he gets, he gets a solo hey, Everyone's who, who like, no! Who gave him the solo? What happened? No, that's a no from me I no. kind of like it But you said it was your <laughs> least favourite sauce I mean, That's so odd to By me. itself, I hate it so much The food pairing saved it for you the, Yeah, like a lot of pecan to like good pieces of bacon It just tastes like, like I was having a good brunch Ollie, deciding vote A thousand times no <laughs> Okay Alright Okay Next up What? Saucy sauce. sauce I wasn't aware of saucy sauce but apparently if you mix ketchup and mayo uh, 50-50. I thought it was called burger sauce. Yeah, me too. Okay. I love this. Yeah, I, I do not it. like ketchup, but the, I can handle this. All right, what do we got? Okay. okay. Texture's getting a little worrying now. It looks the most ice cream like. This to me. looks like an apricot. What does it look sorbet? like? Strawberry. Uh, sorbet. Oh. If this, You're we've learned anything from this exercise, it's been I really like sweet, conventional flavored ice cream. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Literally. Burger, Saucy sauce. Burger sauce. Yeah. How bad could, they, could it get? No. <laughs> the aftertaste just sticks around. Surprisingly similar to the salad cream one. This tastes like a exactly like Thousand Island. I think Thousand Island is also made like that. This isn't a Thousand Island. It's not even a hundred island. flavor. It's like one archipelago. One. <laughs> oh, an archipelago could have a hundred islands. I'll definitely have, to with, have this with french fries. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> this is my least favorite. It just tastes like cold ketchup and mayo to me. Okay, serving suggestion. For a topping twist, try adding Heinz sweet chili sauce, crushed Wait, peanuts, what? sweet chili and sauce a on top of saucy and sauce. And a squeeze of lime. Okay. Sure to satisfy oh, even shit. the most adventurous of taste buds. Oh, okay. It's not flipping tequila. Why are we having lime with it? Wow, oh, the chef in the lab sweet. must have had fun making this. Shit. <laughs> I'm doing it. Sweet chili sauce. Okay, let me see. Whoa! <laughs> I honestly think I just felt my soul leave my body. <laughs> Once that oh, you are over with the coldness of this uh, ice cream, uh, feels like you're having a egg roll or a samosa. You know what I mean? Once that you stop thinking it's an ice cream... Mind over matter. Tell me again what it tastes like. It tastes like when you do <laughs> a tiny it. takeaway and you order... <laughs> It works. And you order spring it works. rolls, you just dip it in Ooh, yeah. sweet chili sauce and you have that aftertaste of the egg roll. Oh, you're eating more, I literally... And like the <laughs> 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 
the, the vegetables and the noodle inside. The noodles, say, oh, keep talking gross. about noodles. <laughs> Just watching you eat it is making me gag. Okay, finale of this video is the one you're all waiting for. Heinz ketchup oh, no. ice cream. Now they have sold out of this. Looks like strawberry so ice cream. So we had to improvise the recipe based on the, all of the things that we'd learned. Okay, making what they're like the ingredients of the other the other oh, ice creams. Look at that. Doesn't that just look so appealing? All right. You can tell this one's melted a bit more. I don't like ketchup in the best of times. <laughs> I love ketchup. I can put a bit more on top of your ice cream if you want. Would you like a little squeeze? There you go. Oh, oh, there you go. Um, oh. <laughs> All right, here we go. Cheers. Doesn't smell that bad. Oh, why is it not cold? <laughs> Josh is gonna hate this because it tastes really strongly of ketchup. That's not enjoyable. Oh, I'd rather just have ketchup. Ooh. You're just having only the ketchup? Yeah. I mean, it doesn't work. All right, what's the serving suggestion? Meringue and oh, vampire's really blood. Okay, well, look, this might save it, you know. I do like meringue. I feel like my palate is going to need an act of God to be cleansed <laughs> after this. <laughs> Ready? Should we eat it all in one? Okay. Oh, the sauce looks like ketchup. I could only taste the berry. I only taste the berry and the meringue. That's fine for me. Oh. <laughs> oh, the vinegar. I don't think Heinz should move into the ice cream market. No, they really should. I think they should move out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the mayonnaise for me was doable. It's like you said. Mayonnaise is nice. It starts off as a novelty, but then you stick around because it's kind of actually yeah. good. That was the big surprise, I think. I really don't feel well. Thank you so much, Gabby, for joining us on this episode, this culinary adventure mm. through Heinz's marketing ploy. <laughs> Not a sponsored episode, guys. We uh, put ourselves through that entirely uh, self-willingly. That's been Heinz ice cream. We try it so you don't have to. In the meantime, we'll see you jolly soon. See you later. Bye. Bye. I kind of want more mayonnaise just to wash it down. So I'm trying to think of the perfect example of something that is novelty. The only thing I could think of was like Gordon Ramsay on TikTok.